Welcome to Filmmaking Insights. I'm your host, James Williams. Today, we're exploring the effectiveness of film festivals for independent filmmakers. Festivals have long been seen as vital platforms for indie filmmakers to showcase their work, gain recognition, and secure distribution deals. But how effective are they? Let's delve into the landscape of film festivals and their impact on indie filmmaking careers. Film festivals provide unmatched exposure. Major events like Sundance, TIFF and Cannes can catapult unknown filmmakers into the global spotlight. Being selected for these prestigious festivals signals to the industry that your work deserves serious attention. For example, Damien Chazelle's Whiplash began as a short film that won at Sundance before evolving into an Oscar-winning feature. Stories like this highlight the potential of festivals as launchpads for cinematic careers. Distribution opportunities also abound at festivals. Films like Little Miss Sunshine were picked up by distributors after their Sundance premieres. Leading to critical and commercial success, Sundance has a strong track record of discovering new talent and facilitating distribution deals that propel films into mainstream success. Get Out and Brooklyn are prime examples. Gaining traction after their Sundance debuts, Cannes, often seen as the pinnacle of film festivals, is renowned for its high-profile premieres and prestigious awards like the Palme d'Or. While the festival is associated with big-budget films, it also showcases groundbreaking indie films. Quentin Tarantino's Pulp Fiction, which won the Palme d'Or at Cannes, became a global phenomenon despite its modest budget, showing the festival's power to elevate indie films to iconic status. TIFF is another key player, especially for films aiming to make an impact in North America. The festival's People's Choice Award has become a strong predictor of future success, with films like Slumdog Millionaire sweeping the Oscars after winning at TIFF. The Berlin International Film Festival is also a prestigious platform, especially for politically and socially relevant films. Jafar Panahi's Taxi, which won the Golden Bear at Berlin, brought global attention to the filmmaker's work, despite restrictions in Iran. However, not all festivals are created equal. While top-tier festivals like Sundance, Cannes and TIFF offer substantial benefits, many smaller or lesser-known festivals may not provide the same level of exposure or industry connections. Some festivals have even been criticised for being little more than money-making schemes. The Hollywood International Moving Pictures Film Festival, for example, has faced scrutiny for accepting many films without rigorous selection, diluting the prestige of being chosen. Similarly, the North American Film Awards have a reputation for prioritising profit over quality, leaving filmmakers feeling their work wasn't truly valued. Online-only festivals and streaming events have also become more common, especially during the COVID-19 pandemic. While these festivals offer convenience and lower costs, they often lack the networking opportunities and industry attention that live events provide. Before submitting to an online festival, research the organisers, judges and past participants to ensure the event offers real value. Recently, there has been concern that some of the biggest film festivals are becoming increasingly corporate, making it harder for truly independent films to break through. Films labelled independent at these festivals sometimes have substantial backing from major studios or feature well-known actors and directors. This trend raises questions about what independent really means in today's festival circuit. For instance, the trial of the Chicago 7, which premiered at TIFF in 2020, was marketed as an independent film. However, with a significant budget and a director like Aaron Sorkin, it sparked debates about its independent status. The presence of such films at festivals can overshadow truly indie projects, making it challenging for genuine indie filmmakers to gain the recognition they deserve. While film festivals offer many opportunities for exposure, distribution and recognition, they are not a guaranteed path to success. Independent filmmakers must carefully consider where to submit their work and be mindful of the increasingly corporate nature of some festivals. By doing so, they can maximise the potential benefits while avoiding the pitfalls of the festival circuit. For more insights, subscribe to our channel and visit us at 4dlegacystudios.com.